bit. Daddy's gonna blame you. You know he's gonna blame you for this. Let him. From now on, you stay out of my way. Commissioner Scorpio, we're bringing in the prisoner now. You. You did this to Spinelli. I came in to the park ourselves on. There's a bench here, okay? Oh, here, I'll help. Oh, my hey, cat. Oh, it's okay. We hit it. It's Sam. Oh, hi. Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you. I've been dropping stuff all day. I'm sure I bought too much. I don't know how you juggle it all. Here, put your stuff on the bench, please. Sometimes neither do I, but I just count my blessings every day. What are you guys up to? Well, we are meeting Lucky for the Parade of Lights. Yeah, that's, uh, that sounds like a lot of fun. Kim really likes watching the, the, um, the boats all lit up going to the point and back. All right, that's a, that's a boat on fire. Close to Jason Spears. I evacuated the ship before I had it blown up. None of your people were hurt. I can't promise that's going to be the case the next time. Well, thank you very much, but how 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 much do you want to push? What are you talking? You brought a shipment through my lanes and tried to land it on my well, property. I know the docks. I've been using them for well, years. You're running shipments for Anthony's a car now, Sonny. What do you want me to do? I run it where I want it and when I want it, which means you're going to have to back off. I talk to Sam, okay? Wonder if the parade of lights would be canceled. Okay, I'll be the one to say it. I know, um, you're probably wondering if Jason is on that ship. I can't have feelings about it one way or another. After Jake was taken, I can't be with Jason. It was a mutual decision, and I'm not going back on it. Elizabeth, you are a great mom. The kids are my responsibility. No one's going to keep them safe and happy but me. I've jeopardized them long enough. I'm not going to do it again. All right, look, I'm going um, to go check things out, and let me see if Jason's okay. I'm sure if you know, it might be. It might be a lot easier. I don't want to know. Sonny, this is my territory. You try to move in, I have to defend it. Let's get out of here before the cops show up. Get a minute. Okay. We gotta stop this before it gets out of here. You need to stop this. No, no, no. no you, you, we need to compromise. Come, would you try to take back your territory? I don't see how that's a compromise. No, so no. I asked you to let me in. We can do business here. Together. It's not about right and wrong. No, you just no, let me use it. My lane stays will become unstable. I've got a lot of people looking for me. Okay, I'm responsible for that. You think I would jeopardize uh, my former? I think daughter? you already have jeopardized them. We work together. We might be bad guys. I don't think you want a war, but that's where this is headed. And it's gonna blow up in our face. Can we stop talking like this is mutual? This is Jason's fault. He took away your children. And now he's blowing up your shipments? This is a matter of national security. <laughs> I know, sir, there's been a grievous error in judgment. This way. Spinelli, don't you say another word to those creeps! A matter of national security, Spinelli? This is insane. These people are lying. They're setting Spinelli up. I told you that's enough. Further discussions with the suspect will be private. Dad, please do something. You have to help him. I'm actually I'm sure the paperwork is in order. I'll have more information for you once I've interrogated the prisoner. How could you turn on Spinelli like that? He, he violated national security. Oh! What now? You're gonna file assault charges against me? 
Go ahead, use your badge to bully me like you did to Spinelli. The investigation wasn't personal. Spinelli thought you were his friend, and you took advantage of his kind and generous nature. Well, I have a feeling you did it before me. Yeah, I did, and I feel awful. But do you feel the least bit remorse? I mean, with all the horrible people out there doing awful things, do you feel bad that you wasted your time targeting poor Spinelli? Are you aware of your multiple crimes, Mr. Spinelli? No, no, sir. No, sir. Hacking into government defense systems, Interpol, witness protection data, high-level security files, and monitoring systems. Pretty intense stuff for the local computer whiz. Well, I assure you, it was not intended to harm. It was espionage. And high treason. There's plenty of room for all of us. You guys can coexist. You could you could live and you could let live. Claudia. What? Stay I'm saying out of the it. same thing you are. Does your does your wife speak for you? Hey, you, know that. you know what? Sonny was bringing in a shipment and you just blew it to bits, Jason. No warning, just boom, gone. How do you expect him to respond to that okay. kind of betrayal? Hey, okay. I extended an offer no, of peace. No, you did not. You moved in on my territory without my permission. Okay. That's not peace. Say what you want to say. Just watch your back. Jason, it's an emergency. Jason, whoa, 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 hold on. I'm sorry. Sorry, I wasn't spying on you. Um, I would. Uh, Maxie's freaking out. Spinelli's in trouble. Can you please talk to her? Ma Maxie, Maxie, just, just calm down, okay? And tell me, tell me what's going on. Arrested by the FBI. They're in an interrogation room right now. The, the senior agent, some guy named Rainer. He's obviously grilling poor Smelly. Looks like a deer caught in the headlights. You have to do something. Okay, I want you to call Diane, and if they let you interview Spinelli, I want you to tell him to say nothing at all, and I'm on my way. Hurry, please. Yeah, I'm gonna fix this. That was quite a promise. Yeah, Maxie said something about Agent Rainer. He wants he wants me to cooperate. I don't know what he wants. Oh, damn it. What? Well, it's just that Spinelli came over to my apartment the other day and I tried to warn him because Rainer had mentioned his name, but he couldn't focus because somebody hacked into his computer. Somebody hacked into yeah. Spinelli's yes. computer. Well, if it was the FBI, they have all the evidence they need. I assume that the FBI is hoping that this is going to lead to a connection for Jason, but it could be argued that anything on Spinelli's computer is his own work and does not implicate Jason. My guess is they're trying to persuade him to testify against Jason. Oh, I doubt that Mr. Grasshopper would ever consider such a thing. You're his attorney. Maybe you should let him know it might be in his best interest. Good luck. Mr. Miller. interrogation room, Jason. Who you are and what you do, I don't think has ever been real to Spinelli until this moment. It's is bad, Jason. The FBI alleges that Spinelli has hacked into multiple law enforcement databases, uh, defense grids, tax returns, you name it. The list goes on. Okay, do they have proof? If they do, then Spinelli may very well be beyond our help. Spinelli, are you okay? Step back, please. You, he's not a criminal. Let you have to let him go. You can't do this, Diane. Tell him he's innocent. Miss, you're interfering with a federal investigation. I'm not just going to stand here and let you guys lock up my friend. Maxie, let it go. Mr. Morgan, we need a private moment. Not without benefit of counsel. Come if you will, but it will be better for Mr. Spinelli if your client confers with me alone. I can't. It's, it's okay. I fear your optimism is completely mistaken. No, 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 but Diane is here, and she's the best attorney around, and Jason promised no, that you can fix it. Even Stone Cold cannot swear the federal ones. I'm scared. You arrest Spinelli to get to me. That's right. And make no mistake. Damien Spinelli's freedom and quite possibly his life are on the line. Unless you do exactly as we say.